Little trooper chasing green. Little trooper, yeah, he mean. Yo, it's that J Young RA man. I'm back with another video. So today, I'm here to tell y'all, bruh, that slavery never ended. You know what I'm saying? Slavery never ended. So the 13th Amendment, that's the so-called amendment that amendment that abolished slavery, right? But nah, if, if y'all read the whole amendment, at the bottom of the amendment it says, you are free, you are not a slave no more, unless you do something illegal, something like that. Unless you do something illegal or you get locked up. So basically, they saying that nigga, <laughs> when your ass locked up, you a slave again, bruh. You feel me? You basically a slave when you locked up. It's in the 13th Amendment. You can search it up, nigga. Read that shit for yourself. You know, bruh, that shit crazy. So, bruh, if you really think about it, slavery never ended. You know, it really never ended. I've been to about this, though. You know what I'm saying? With mass incarceration, stuff like that. Like, black brothers getting locked up for selling drugs, all of that. It's, it's fucked up out here, bruh. So basically, the whole time, bruh, we been slaves. That shit crazy. And nowadays, with the newer generations and shit like that, we got a slave mentality, bruh. Especially the females. I be feeling bad for these females, bro. We got a fucked up mentality, bro. Like these females, all they, I, I ain't, I ain't go bash them, you know. I ain't go bash them this video. But these females wearing weed, wearing weed, wearing lace fronts, you know what I'm saying? Makeup, like where the natural beauty at, bro? When I look at these females nowadays, I don't see no beauty in them, bruh. To be real with you. I don't see no beauty in these females wearing lace fronts. You know, lace fronts, that's white people. I ain't, I ain't gonna bash white people either, but that's white people hair, bruh. That's Caucasian hair. That is not black African nappy hair, bruh. Why the fuck is you wearing a lace front? Take that shit off, nigga. That is not natural black beauty, you know? Yo, nappy hair, that's what I want to see. Take that weave out, take that lace front out. What the fuck? Ain't nobody want to see that European shit, man. Take that shit off your head. Real shit. But like, yeah, we in a, we live in a slave mentality, bruh. Not only, not only we're still slaves from mass incarceration and shit, Cause them black, all my brothers, all them boys locked up, man. Free all of them, man. That shit fucked up. But yeah, not only we slaves from being locked up, but we slaves mentally, you know, spiritually. Mo we just still slaves, bruh. And like the government, the elites and stuff, them niggas twisted the game, bruh. They twisted the game so they can get you mentally. Once they get you mentally, bruh, it's easy for them. They don't got to worry about you. They ain't got to worry about us protesting, fighting for our rights and shit. They ain't got to worry about that. Because they got us up here, bruh. We comfortable. We too comfortable. And, like, we too comfortable with this shit. We got houses now. Nigga, ain't nobody finna protest nowadays, bruh. You think now? Niggas go fight. Um, people go fight for their rights now? In 2021? Fuck no. Nowadays, people got houses. They got niggas straight. Niggas, people got money now. You know, black people got money. So, but back then, like in the 60s, them niggas ain't had, they, they ain't had shit. They ain't had nothing, bruh. Them boys, walk, they was walking to work. They was doing all of that. So they was all, they was all on go, bruh. They were all ready to fight. For what is theirs they was ready to fight bruh but nowadays people are comfortable 
nowadays people comfortable and everything everybody settled everybody got everybody eating everybody got food in the fridge you know so now people ain't ready to fight bro they comfortable they ain't they ain't got nothing to fight for bro you know what i'm saying but shit, yeah we still mentally we still slaves we got to get out of that slave mentality, bruh. If y'all know if y'all know any females or send this to any female, bruh, or any girl, bruh, that wear weave and shit like that. If your girlfriend, all the guys out there, if your girlfriend wear weave or lace front, tell your girlfriend she beautiful how she is and she don't need no lace front or no weave. She beautiful with her nappy hair, bruh. Tell her that. And then see see how this shit go for you, bruh. Just, yeah, you don't need no lace front. Girl, you don't need no lace front and no weed to feel beautiful, bruh. You don't need none of that shit. Come on now. You don't need that white people hair, bruh. You straight with your nappy African hair. But yeah, y'all, this is a quick little video. I just want to let y'all know, bruh. Y'all got to really love yourself, bruh. Love how you is, bruh. How God made you, bruh. No makeup, no filter. Just how, how you came out. How you came out the womb. You got to love yourself just how you are, bruh. Straight like that. See you on the next.